Hello everyone, welcome. This is Feline Intuition 1111. This is going to be a collective reading. Let's see what messages want to come out for you. Keep in mind this may or may not resonate for you on this particular day, but let's see what comes out. What do we have for the collective? Fated meeting. Grass is greener. <laughs> Fear and single. Okay, some of you are about to meet someone. You could have met someone already. But you could have some fear surrounding this situation. Let's see. What are the messages for the collective? Hmm. So we have don't step out of character trying you pushing buttons be the bigger person zero to 100 real quick we have a good karma and treat yourself don't cheat yourself we also have side eyes someone acting like they got amnesia a line of questioning is needed if they if they brought it to you Ooh, what was that <laughs> if they brought it to you they were talking about you too so this card may be important because that noise just came out of nowhere from my neighbors. <laughs> what are the messages for the collective? Messages for the collective. What do they need to know? So I see, hold on, I see you being quite focused on something to do with yourself, maybe it's work, maybe it's working on yourself, but I see two people <laughs> coming towards you and one of them is going to make you see things differently, maybe see love differently, maybe they're going to take this fear away if you do have some anxiety surrounding love. But one of them could be someone who doesn't want to lose you to this other person. Let me see. What's this eight of pentacles? Some of you are working on something creative. You're definitely wanting to take your mind off of anything negative here by focusing on something good. And you have the ace of wands as well so it's like you're focused on something but you got people coming in why the knight of pentacles six of wands the empress and you know some of you whatever you're working on it could be moving um at a slow pace but it's definitely leading to some kind of long-term success and recognition there's some forward movement. Some of you could be traveling soon and there's definitely like you're attracting what it is that you want. Some of you could be working on your physical appearance. You definitely got people coming in really admiring how you look as well. Why the Knight of Cups? Yeah, there is someone who... You're not in communication with, they could be, you know, hiding with the moon or hiding how they feel. They are kind of stuck in their head. I see this person all of a sudden coming towards you with this Knight of Cups. Why the Three of Cups in reverse? You're going to have, oh my goodness. Four of Swords in reverse. You're going to have a choice to make between two or more people. I just see you attracting with that Empress and the Nine of Pentacles. I see you attracting a lot of things, including people, and you're going to find yourself. I feel like your goal is to just do you and make something happen for yourself, but it's actually, it's actually attracting people, even someone who tried not to be in communication with you like they tried to hold back why the hangman why's the hangman here 
Yeah, someone's surrendering. Someone's gonna make you safe, like feel safe to, to be vulnerable. We have the Six of Cups here. It's like you're gonna see someone surrendering to you and they're gonna make you feel safe. Why the fool? The world. Ace of Cups. Five of Cups. You are taking a leap in love despite having disappointments in the past or feelings of rejection in the past someone's really challenging your fear here when it comes to love whoever this person is that's coming in i do see a past person coming in and i see another person coming in who could be new but somebody is um maybe they've been hurt and they're also taking a leap with you so you kind of They kind of give you the courage to do the same. Why the judgment in reverse? I do feel like for some of you, there's a the past person who feel, who hasn't learned their lessons. They kind of still have toxic energy. I see you not really seeing a future with them. Why the magician in reverse? Yeah, someone you've had a breakup with, they're going to be acting or they're going to try and manipulate their way back in. I see you rejecting them, but they're going to try. But I feel like it's this this other person that's making you see things differently. Like making you go for something different, a different type of love. It's more effortless. But it happens when you're working on something Especially something to do with work that's actually gonna take off even if you think it's moving slow could be a Capricorn for some of you We've got Leo cancer air signs as well Gemini Libra Aquarius so yeah I do see some good karma but I see a past person trying to manipulate their way in that could be why you're being asked not to step out of character because they're probably going to annoy you. Let's see what else comes up. Okay, what are the messages for the collective? What are the messages? There is a gossiping person. We have the Queen of Wands in reverse. So if someone does come to you with rumors, they were probably involved. But we'll see what's going on with that. We got Libra energy here. Scorpio, I'm seeing that someone feels you've turned your back on them. They feel like it's unfair. They could be playing the victim right now. Um, and they don't want things to change. They don't like that things are changing, that you're changing. Why the three of wands in reverse? Yeah, they feel like you're juggling. They feel like they're still carrying feelings for you. These are feelings that this person didn't acknowledge at the time or they didn't feel like they needed to acknowledge at the time or to tell you how they felt at the time. Now they're carrying these feelings at a time where you've decided to do your own thing so them feeling like it's unfair is kind of like they're in victim mode 
because they had they had all the time in the world. And we have the Eight of Cups in reverse, so they're like unsettled. Why the Justice in reverse? They feel like you have the upper hand in this um, breakup or separation. They feel like you're quite comfortable and happy. Careful with this person. They, may, they might want to come at you like this Knight of Swords because you're at peace and happy and stable. And they feel like that's unfair. They feel like... <laughs> it's funny because now they feel like they're carrying the weight of the relationship. When some of you might have carried the weights of the relationship during the relationship. Why the Ace of Wands? So some of you have a new love. It's making someone jealous too. Ace of Cups. Not Ace. Page of Cups. Clarifying the Ace of Wands and the Knight of Cups in reverse. You're being seen as someone who... Is starting something new some of you already have a new love maybe people can see it or they're about to but this is how you're being seen and someone is jealous with this knight of cups in reverse it does have someone in their feelings most likely this victim over here this person <laughs> that had all the time in the world to be a part of the relationship fully why the six of wands Sorry, why the Six of Swords? <clears throat> six of Cups, Five of Cups in reverse, Ten of Swords in reverse. This person's trying to get over the situation. They're going through some kind of pain, some, some kind of feelings here that they don't like. Their goal is to get over the situation, especially if you have already moved on. They feel like they have no choice, but they are carrying the feelings, feeling burdened by the feelings. Why the page of cups in reverse? The emperor in reverse. So this person, okay, five, five, four of swords, four of swords and the emperor in reverse. this person they don't know how to handle their emotions when it comes to you either moving on to someone new or just not paying them any mind they don't know how to handle it some of you they have an apology for you but they fear it will be rejected and they are like really worried about <laughs> their ego here They're worried. Yeah, there's somebody who wants to apologize, but they're scared. They feel like, hold on, why the death card in reverse? Five of Wands, we also have the Five of Wands twice. Five of Wands is blocking. So, this person has seen that there's competition for your love. Or they could just feel that way. There are two of swords in reverse. This person, like maybe in the past they didn't realize this, but now they're realizing that there's actually, I don't know if they thought that they were the only person that you could get or what, but they are now realizing that there's other people trying to get with you. And for them, that's what's blocking them, competition. They're very focused on other people's um, actions towards you. We have the Five of Cups again. So someone is definitely in their feelings because you are paying them no mind. Why the Three of Swords? Death. Could be a Scorpio. Moon could be a Pisces. Goodness. This is uh 
This is their next move towards you, okay? They are hurt. Someone is heartbroken here. It can't be a new person because a new person wouldn't be heartbroken over you because some of you haven't met them yet or it's just too soon for that to even happen if it's even gonna happen. Because a new love doesn't like something that's gonna turn out to be heartbreak. Because it says the grass is greener. <laughs> so this is a definitely a past person's actions, near future actions. And it looks to me like they're heartbroken because you've made a lot of changes. You've become a whole new person behind the scenes, especially some of you could have been, you know, you could have done this behind the scenes, just focused on yourself and healed without telling anyone or showing anything. This could also speak about the fact that they've been hiding this heartbreak. Why the Queen of Wands in reverse? There is some gossip with with ill intent. We got the Three of Pentacles, so there's a group of people gossiping. Could be at work or school or wherever you frequent where there's groups of people. Could even be on social media, but These are people who, these are people who don't really, they feel like they're not getting as much rewards or results as you in whatever they're working towards. Tell me about this gossip, it's Queen of Wands in reverse energy. Yeah, it's because you're getting your fruits and they feel like they're they're not really harvesting anything in their life so again whoever brings this gossip to you is the one that was involved it doesn't have to be but we did have the high priestess in reverse with this deck at the bottom and we have it here clarify the high priestess in reverse please Yeah, someone's trying to create some type of illusion. Be careful of what anyone tries to come and tell you. They're trying to create some kind of illusion. With the high priestess in reverse and seven of cups. And we have the eight, the page of wands in reverse. These could be very like immature, petty people. I wouldn't trust anyone's advice but your own and your own intuition because... Someone's trying to create some kind of illusion here. Clarify the five of wands, please. Why is this blocking? Wow, <laughs> two aces. You could have two people trying to have a new beginning with you or trying to start something with you like romantically. Also, I do feel like there's competition. I feel like it's both. It's to do with love and people trying to make their way to the top when it comes to you. It could be in the work field because we have justice in reverse. So some people feel like it's unfair. There's something that you're getting that they feel is unfair. With the Ace of Swords, Ace of Pentacles. Let me see what else we got. What are the messages for the collective? Emotional storm, turmoil, unstable, affected. Apology, forgiveness, return, sorry. There is definitely someone in their feelings. They've been hiding this. The moon. Influences, attachments, third parties, peers. I feel like that's linked to the gossip, but we'll clarify it. We have silence, frozen, no words, stonewall. Oh, okay. Boundaries, protecting your energy. Protecting your energy is self-care. You see how that came out? You definitely, this card, we got solitude, lonely. Yeah, it's like you, 
may have to be a bit lonely for a bit until you find your soul tribe, your real people, because I see in the outcome some weird people around you are going to try and like gaslight in some kind of way, create some kind of illusion. And it's because you're getting further than them and they want to confuse you. I guess they want to slow you down in some way. So the way how this card came out is definitely... And then the lonely, you might find that you might have to distance yourself. Maybe you're in a work environment where these people are there and maybe you plan on moving from that work environment and doing something for yourself, like working for yourself or creating something. But as long as you're around these people, because you're going further than them, they're going to try to confuse you. Got dying love, breakup, separation. What do we have for the collective? Betrayal. Watch your back and your front. For sure. Rise from the ashes and the veil, denial. What's the influences? Why did this card come out? Influences third parties. You could be on the verge to some kind of financial success, work success, business success, but it's like someone wants to delay it for you. So be careful of any influences. Like I said, the people trying to confuse you. For some of you, this could be to do with the relationship. You could have felt like this person had third parties involved. This could be why some of you walked away. Clarify betrayal, please. Two of Wands. Yeah, Queen of Wands in reverse again. You, the person who brings the gossip to you, they are the ones not to trust as well. And someone is planning something, be careful with the two of ones. Someone's planning their next action. And it has to do with trying to dim your light or making you unhappy. Yeah, the, whoever is queen of ones in reverse, is there, they got plans. And it could be just like mind games that they want to play with this high priestess in reverse. So you really have to be careful of like what people say and not to um, take it to heart, okay? Just see them as weird and that's it. See them as upset, unhappy, and that's it. Why breakups? Clarify this card. Yeah, there is a there is someone you had a breakup with. They. King of Swords, they could be, they could be narcissistic or in, or just in survival mode basically, because I see that they were someone who was hiding how they felt. Now they're feeling what they feel and they're not comfortable with it. They definitely feel very unstable without you. And it could be that you're very detached from them. What are the messages for the collective? Triangle, crowded relationship, choices, dating, whining, dining, romance, passion, chemistry, passionate feelings, destiny, luck chance meant to be and union serious relationship marriage partnership you're gonna have somebody here some of you are gonna have a choice at first with the triangle but you'll be dating someone and there's gonna be a very passionate connection here let's see other messages 
keep your eyes open for better love opportunities not every relationship has a happy ending true love requires compromise and playing games will get you nowhere so this person could have played games a lot and it has gotten them nowhere it has gotten them to a place where they're just stuck with the feelings that they try to deny with that denial card clarify the triangle please oh could be dealing with a virgo virgo scorpio pisces aries but we got this king of wands in reverse for some of you, this ex of yours could be very, like, if you do have, like, options, they could be very annoyed by that. Very bothered, feeling very rejected and upset. Okay, my apologies, it got a bit loud. Let's see, clarify the passion card, please. You know what? For a small amount of you... <laughs> You could actually have an encounter with the past person for some, not all. And it could be one like this. Maybe you just feel like doing it again, or less like one more time or a couple more times. I don't know. But with the judgment in reverse, clarifying this, somebody might jump back into bed with the past person before they move on. Or maybe you're getting back with the past person, but I don't know. I see you guys having choices. But clarifying the passion card is the judgment in reverse with strength in reverse, which means for some of you, you got a past person who, let's just say you had memorable times with and you decide you want to do it again because, because why not? And maybe you're able to just keep it as that and, you know, keep it moving. I don't know. Or maybe you want to get back with them. Yeah, I'm seeing that for some of you. Clarified, um, don't step out of character. Six of swords. Five of swords in reverse. People are going to be trying to try you. That's, this is true. With the work situation or maybe it's family or something. Whoever you're rising above, they're going to be trying you. I see you moving away from it. I see you... I see you successfully, you know, avoiding it. But they're going to try. Is what I'm seeing. Let's see. What do we have? We've got overcoming challenges. What do we have for the collective? Reaching out. Bad timing. Free yourself and friends to lovers. Ooh, for some of you, if it's not a, if it's not you doing that with a past person, it could be that you end up being with a friend. Romantically. This past person might reach out to you at a bad time. But hmm. let's get some messages from this deck. What else for the collective? Ooh. Boss. Master of wealth, risks investments management leader some of you could be maybe you're getting a promotion but you're definitely rising above some people here this is why they're upset we got brotherhood of the shadows underworld transactions and all kinds of bad stuff there could i don't know why this card came out this gang card but let's see Chef, culinary, mas culinary mastero. Is that a thing? I don't know. Cooking, culinary artistry, seasoning. I don't know what that says. I cannot pronounce that word. 
looks like some kind of cooking <laughs> cooking lingo traveler seeker of the horizon seeker of horizons adventure experience long journey some of you could be traveling athlete seeker of vitality exercise life strength speed some of you could be athletic but these are just some like job titles here and characteristics why did chef come out some of you could be like passionate about food and it helps to kind of heal you like feel better or just being creative because chefs are like really creative they don't just cook why did this underworld card come out yeah there's a narcissist if this is clarifying that card this card don't even want to show the words on it but you know what i mean if this is clarified by the king of swords in reverse which is the narcissistic card is that type of energy you know being ruthless and then we got the nine of swords so you could have dealt with someone like this and we got the page of swords in reverse as well I don't know if this person's talking negatively about you or still like stalking. Maybe it's a narcissistic ex. One of the more, you know, more toxic ones. More ruthless ones. But they could have caused a lot of stress. Why did this come out though? What's going to happen with the situation? You're definitely going to meet someone better. Wow, yeah. They're going to be mad about this person. Sorry, there's music. Okay, that music got way too loud. But I'm seeing that you're going to meet someone way more stable, whether it's financially or stable as a person or both. But this person's bringing in a lot of peace. Some of you could have met them already. But I see that the past person does not like the fact that this person is making you very happy. I don't know if they're going to try and come towards you. Like I said earlier, they could be trying to come forward to like, Manipulate the situation. This could be the same ex this has been talking about, or it could be a different ex for some of you. But I definitely see someone who isn't so nice coming towards you because they see you like very happy with someone who's very stable. Okay, so yeah. The main message is, is to protect your energy from the people who are currently around you right now. If you are like stepping closer towards this nine of pentacles, they don't mean you well. They do have tricks up their sleeve is what I'm seeing. And you're definitely needing to, pro needing to protect your energy from them. And I'm seeing possibly new love definitely meeting a new person some of you it could be a friend already that could turn into a romantic relationship and then <laughs> i do have some of you here reconnecting with someone maybe short term or maybe long term but i definitely see somebody who held back their feelings and now they're having to really carry their feelings for you because they felt like they could just hold back and tell you how they felt or, you know, treated you better whenever they felt like it. So this is what I'm seeing. Could be dealing with a Pisces or a Scorpio, Aries. Um, Taurus. Leo. So that music got loud again while I was listing the signs. There's definitely Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Earth signs, mainly Taurus, and we had Libra. So I hope this was helpful. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.